Emilia sa Emily, the only Emily, Emily Potorinto, Potorinto, Emily the Emilia. Emilia, I want to go, only you. Ah. Emilia, Fana, see as you they shine from head to toe, from back, from west, from chest, everywhere. Emily Potorinto! Emily, you mix? You look great? You look good from head to toe, they call me Emily, baby. Am I your mix? I'm going to have a selfie for you. What's your wife buy? Why you don't shut my name? What's your one buy? Why do you want buy? I'll ask you! Now why you slap me? Why not slap you? Uh, because of sad, they hear you over your food. What you they give me? Is that meaning your mates? Is she your mates? I better mean, calm down, huh? I just call your shirt, someone I can't eat. Now you don't give me slap anyhow. Why don't I slap you? You don't call me a mini baby. You open your cotton mask, they call me a mini baby. See, I mean, not try me again, no. Not try me again. You send up your, your food, no, they give me colos, eh? I for, I for my two dab slap bars. You don't rest? I get out. Get out! Not a behavior anyhow. But still go call your shock, aren't you? You're gonna slap me. I can leave my shock. Get out. Just get out. Nah, yeah. Very foolish boy. Foolish boy. You look very foolish. As I feel rich, you don't come here, mini baby. What the fuck are you there? Let me see you here again. With your tetra busters. Foolish boy. Foolish boy. Let me see you here again. Idiot. Emily, baby. You, you don't know your mates. Just now, eh? Come back here again. It's what I'll do to you. Idiot. Emily, baby. You don't know your mates. Because now, I, 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 I serve food now. You don't. Hi guys, my name is Messi Johnson, a Nollywood actress. Subscribe to Nollywood Classic TV. You want to see the best movies? Subscribe to Nollywood Classic TV. Hi y'all. Iron condemn, iron condemn. Rubber condemn, plastic condemn. Human being condemn. When will you stop picking the trash? You didn't fall a hand for this street, though. How are you gonna call something where they put food for my table trash? Now nah, there is dignity in level, not be trash. Now my hustle, I suppose they're proud of her. Raymond, stop saying this. I've asked you to come join our cartel. Eh? Sumiane, my bro. Not be saying I don't get mine to follow you, teeth. But my conscience, maybe. I don't go see, for night I don't go be sleep. I wanna go be thief. So leave that matter. This is why I do small small. One day, one day. God fear elevate me from here. Raymond, listen. This thing cannot get you paid. How can a full grown man choose picking debris on the street? Man, this is bad. It is called stages of life. I don't go wake up one day, hammer. That's small small. From here, God go bless me. Now legit, now. I don't go be doing anything in Lega, no. Calm down, now, bro. Women. Don't, don't, don't just come begging me for money anytime. No, I'm not begging for anything. Iron condemn. Plastic condemn. Waterproof condemn. Woman being condemned. But he's determined to make it in love He's not ashamed of what he does He believed I tomorrow for better Last Don't abuse him Don't abuse him if I pray Everything for them for them Atakarati he don't get it, John. What the hell are you doing? Why are you messing here up? Are you mad? What the hell do you think you are doing? Shut up, I'm talking, you are talking. How dare you? Security! Thank you! Are you where you're coming from? Are you allowed this thing to constitute news as out of my house? Don't touch me. 
Don't touch me. Let this be the first and the last time you will ever come to this place to mess it up. I don't blame you. You say I get money, I know if you marry you. Because you see me like this, you, you, you call me too. Don't be only you get house. Life don't be like that. Anybody if you blow, anybody if you make money tomorrow, you they call me team. Because I had to pick something from your dust bin. Now your fridge be this. Don't be dust bin be this. Bye, our God damn. I am one day. I am one day. Plastic one day. Nylon one day. Woman be one day. This are hard, but man must survive. You must hustle love for you to survive. But you are legit man. Does it matter? What should happen? Why is this face? I the vex. I know they're happy at all. If you see the insult where one lady give me, eh? This babe called me names. She insulted me. What did she not tell me? What did I do? Nothing. I just in front of her gate. They pick rubbish. She begin to insult me. She begin to call me names. Who is that idiot? Who is she? What do you think she is? Eh? Emily, calm down. Emily, just calm down. Why should I calm down? I'm taking care of her. Oh, no problem. Don't worry. I have taken care of her. Ah. Just, just, just give me food. I'm hungry. What nonsense! What if you want chop? Four fufu. I wish I'm drunk. Drop her today. You have come again now. Four fufu again. Four fufu again. You have not paid for yesterday's food. You say you want four fufu. I go pay this. This I'll give you. I go pay this evening. Make him fall. Four fufu. Four fufu. I'm gonna give you one. Four and a number. Make him fall. Right. Are you sure you're going to go on this one food that, that made you squeeze your face? No, that girl insulted me. How can I squeeze you? It's what I'm giving you today. One. Top of Struggling to survive. Things are hard. No one to help. One on one like a... Like this for over two hours now. Your food is still at the dining, getting cold. What is it? Jasmine, I'm fine. I just need some time to rest. Of course, you and I know that you are not fine. I know you, Annabelle. You're my sister. I can tell when something is eating you up. I met this guy earlier this afternoon outside the gate when I was driving in. Okay, what about him? I don't know. But his words... Can you stop? The security told me all that transpired between you. I was hearing noises. I was so curious to know what it was all about. That guy should count himself lucky that I was not the one he met at the gate. Can you, can you imagine the ragamuffin Having the nerves telling you about living in a glass house. Jasmine. 
what if he was right? Annabelle, calm down. Let's go and eat. And let's go of this moral justification of who is right and who is wrong. Please. I'm not hungry. Okay. I'll do fruits. Consider it done. Can we go now? Fine. Let's do fruits. Yeah. Thank you. But man must survive. You must hustle for you to survive. But it money. I'm okay, sir. Fine. Any hunger won't finish me. I'm hungry. Can I have food? Uh, oh, no problem. I hope so you go pay today. No. But I promise tomorrow. Tomorrow I will clear my debt. Raymond, my mother is going to the market tomorrow. And all debts need to be cleared off. You need to pay, Biko. I promise tomorrow I will clear my debt. Please, just let me eat first. I will clear tomorrow. Let me help the needy now. Help the needy. Eh? Sometimes you do charity work. Help the needy. I'm in need. You don't dare sweet talk me like this, sweet you. Whenever you won't get something like this, you will just bring your voice down like a cockroach. You know I increase tempo again. You eh? Okay, eat first. No worry, no worry. I'll give you, but try pay up tomorrow. No tomorrow. Ah. Pay tomorrow. I go clear my debt. You like open. I go clear. Ah. What do you want? Sit down. Man, I get four fufu. I get only four. Not ten. I go give you. Okay, if you don't eat two, you leave them. No, no. Man, I get four fufu. If you don't go eat two, leave them. The one where you eat yesterday, never pay. They find four fufu. Of course, I know who cash. I go pay tomorrow now. You don't eat. I mean, they eat. What shot my? Okay, give me two first, man. Now two I they give you, not be two first. I'll give you two. Give me a bushy and draw. I will pay tomorrow. That means when they get those small, but not really those. You still get choice. You never know if this is yesterday. You want you want those. Now far now I will give you. Not be my first thing. He's not ashamed of what he does. He believes tomorrow for better. Don't abuse him, I come on a yon on a yon Don't abuse him, he fell me, he fell me, he fell me I don't care to him, but He de pick up, what the fuck up next time He de pick up, he no get to jump But my daughter, come on Come, you know we need to restock uh, uh, the, this kitchen we need to restock our kitchen. Eh? But going through this credit book, yeah, the list is numerous. Eh? And our items has finished. Let me handle it. What are we going to do? Mama, let me see. Look at start from here. Start from here. Go through it. Uh -huh. Turn the back. Mama, if I'll be able to collect this money tomorrow, by next tomorrow we'll go to the market. Are you sure? Yes, Mama. Please, we have to do it fast. We don't have anything in the kitchen again. Eh? Mama, it's okay. I'll... Even the beans has finished. It remaining only five cups. Mama, don't worry. Tomorrow I'll go and sort with the money. Hey, oh, it's all right. Go and continue with what you're doing. <laughs> Mom, he has to give her space so she can think and make decisions for herself. Besides, she's matured enough to make her decisions. Hi. Mm -hmm. You want to say hi? Um, um, mom, I guess she's still in bed. She really did stay up late working on a project throughout the night via her laptop. Yes, mommy, I will tell her to return your calls as soon as she wakes up. Please take good care of yourself, Mom. My regards to my daddy. 
love you bye mm. that was so unfair refusing mom's calls good morning annabelle good morning jasmine and for the records i wasn't avoiding mom's call just that she practically tells that everything she tells him everything and i'm not finding it funny anymore big sis i'm sorry the way i sounded Trust me, mom meant no harm. She's really rooting for you. Dad cannot continue detecting your life. You just have to calm down, please. It's, it's, it's fine, Jasmine. Thank you so much. And... I went to the kitchen and I didn't see food. Don't tell me that stupid girl didn't cook the food I asked her to. I think she left a few minutes ago to the market. I don't really know what is taking her mind off her duties. I am not ready to accept her stupid behavior. She's becoming lazy these days. Don't touch me. Don't Let touch me. me. Let this be the first and the last time you will ever come to this place to mess it up. I don't blame you. This is how I get money. I know if you marry you. Because you see me like this, they call me too. Don't be only you, really, you get house. Life don't be like that. Though. Anybody if you blow, anybody if you make money tomorrow. If they call me too, because I, I they pick something from your dust bin. My fridge be this. No be dust bin be this. Bye, Awa. God day. Ayon Kwande! Ayon Kwande! Plastic Kwande! Nylon Kwande! Human being Kwande! Anabi, are you okay? Market. Fine. What brings you here? Sandra, <laughs> you won't believe what my two naked eyes saw today. What did you see? She, you know. Hey, Raymond now. Raymond, that's a uh, uh, iron condemned guy now. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. I remember him, yes. Hmm. What happened to him? I saw him today. He was toasting one fine girl. All of the sudden, a million walked him. Asking him of our money. Eh? <laughs> My dear, you won't believe it. I'm telling you. And what did Raymond do? What did he do? And he insulted her. Insulted her? Yes. My wait. dear, you won't believe what my eyes oh, Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait. What is even wrong with this Raymond? What is wrong with Raymond? My dear, if you ask me, who will I ask? Simply because Emilia is asking him of her money. Somebody that sells food on credits for him. 
and he still insulted her Indeed. on the mirror. What is this one turning into? I don't know. If you ask me, who will I ask? Is Raymond okay? <laughs> so, okay, tell me, after then, what now happened? What did Emilia do? Ah, my dear, I left there. So, you not even finish watching everything that was happening. You just run, just to come and tell me half story. Sandra, what is your problem now? Anyway, what do you have for me? Have Sorry, what? No. Have ah, what? Sandra, Sandra, when you did not finish friend. the story you were telling me. Hey, hey, please, hold it there. You didn't finish the story you were telling me. Sorry now. Uh, Go Sandra. back and finish and come back and tell me what happened. Yeah, my son. What do you want to eat? There is no food, Mama. Food has finished. Go elsewhere and eat. We don't have food. Please, can you see? We cannot see. Did you bring all of the money you're owing me? Did you come with my money? Please come down. Can we, can we see the department? No, we can't. I don't want to talk to you. Get out of the Emilia, you see, I'm deeply sorry for what happened. I'm so ashamed of myself. It was the truth. It will never happen. So. Raymond, I have forgiven you, but I will no longer sell food to you. If you are the last person to sell food or anything to, then I will stop selling food. No, 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 Amy, don't say that. I beg of you, please, don't do that. I said I'm sorry. It will never ever happen again. Please. It gladdens my heart to hear that you've forgiven me. I'm happy now. But oh, please. I'm sorry. You, you, you can't stop selling food. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Listen, Raymond, from the depth of my heart, I have forgiven you. My mother can sell food to you, but not me. No. I have forgiven you. Okay, okay. It's fine. Thanks for forgiving me. I have forgiven you. this evening. Wow. Thank God, though. Eh? That reminds me. What brought about your mood swing this morning? So, the fact that I'm happy now, you, you don't like it, Abby? What's with what happened to me in the morning? Do you want to spoil my mood again? No. You don't want me to enjoy this happy moment? Please don't add to my stress. I'm happy, and that's all that matters. That's not what I meant. Like, I'm, I'm surprised you are this happy. And I'm happy that you are happy. Thank you! Send for me. 
Yes, I did. Please, can you help get my sister a glass of juice? Wait. Hey, hey, Closer. Closer. What's this you wearing in my house? Now, clothes, ma. Why are you wearing rag in my house? Some... I beg no sacrifice. No, 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 I'm not going to take this. And when was the last time you went for shopping? Ma, ma. You know what? Wait, ma. Maid, no, they go shopping. You don't ever hear and see where maid go shopping. You know what? Go to the room. Wear the best of your outfits. We're going for shopping. Okay, you want to go for shopping? Let me help and carry No! Me. I'm taking you for shopping. I want to shop for you. You serious? You heard me. From your heart of hearts. Of course! Is there anything wrong with that? Thank you, ma. You're welcome. Okay, ma. Go! God bless you, ma. Uh, please don't forget to get my sister the juice. I won't, ma. Thank you, ma. Thank you, ma. It's fine. Crazy. Wait. Annabelle? You mean you want Amaka to go out with us? And you want to shop for her? Is there anything wrong with that? Wow. I mean, she is human. She is human. And listen, it's high time we started taking care of both the security guy and the Amaka. We have to treat them like human. They are one. Don't call her a maid. Her name is Amaka. Please. I still don't get it. This are hard, but man must survive. You must hustle for you to survive. But in a legit manner, Raymond Umwa. It doesn't matter if you're dirty, but should the money. A bakala tingwam, eh, it a pickup. What a condemned iron, eh, it a pickup. He no get the money, eh, but he no dey mess up with church, eh. He no get the shish. A baby dey manage himself. A bakala tingwam, eh, it a pickup. What a condemned iron, eh, it a pickup. He no get the money, yeah. but he no dey mess up with church. Eh. Hey, he no get the shish. A baby dey manage himself. A bakala tingwam, eh, he dey pick up. What a condemned iron, eh, he dey pick up. He no get the money, yeah. but he no dey mess up with church. Eh. Hey, he no get the shish. A baby dey manage himself. Bye bye. Mm -hmm. Struggling to survive, things are hard. No one to help, one on a lecker. Ah, what are you? Me to make it love. I get, I get rice, I get soup, I get, I get beans. You get rice, you get soup, you get. Give me apple. How many you want? How many? Four. Huh? Four apples. Four fufu. The bushy and draw. You have today. You have come again now. Four fufu again. Four fufu again. You have not paid for yesterday's food. You say you want four fufu. I go pay this. This I will give you four. Eh, four apples, four apples, four apples. Ah, my brother. What's in there? I want one. I want two. One, two. Yeah. Bring them. I don't understand. Since yesterday, I don't define Raymond. Just define her. What did happen now? Where he go? I don't think everything is all right, though. Because the Raymond where I know, we person where they sleep outside. And I did here yesterday, reach midnight. I did wait for her. I don't see her. It's in the soul. You know, even if he say make he called me. Eh? Suppose not say I go deep worried. I, I don't understand. Ha. 
three months, I beg, I beg. Even if you're not there ready to come back, at least I'll lie your girl now. Eh? I'm desirous. Are you trying to tell me that you've not seen that guy that picks debris around this vicinity again? No, ma. He did not come closer to this place again. After all the things he told him. Okay. Have you eaten? I've eaten, ma. I'm not convinced with what you just said. You know what? Just go to the kitchen and tell Amaka to give you something to eat. Thank you, ma. Well, ma, I've eaten this morning. Actually, I'm just waiting for the night one, as usual. No, that has been abolished. Henceforth, you'll be served three square meal daily. And that's the new order. Thank you, ma. that he hasn't come yet. Mama, I never meant the things I said to him. I need to go look for him. It's all right. If that will rekindle your happiness, you can do that. Thank you, <laughs> Struggling to survive, things are hard. No one to help, one on a lecker. But he's determined to make it in life. Oh. He's not ashamed of what he does. He believes tomorrow will go better. Don't abuse him. Don't abuse him if I nearly gone at her. A bacala thing, but eh, it a pickup. What the condemns I am, eh, it a pickup. He don't get it, joy, but he don't ever support a jet. He don't corrupt, a puppy, they manage himself. A bacala thing, but eh, it a pickup. Picking condemns I am, eh, it a pickup. But Yeah. 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 Yeah.
the parking. Okay. Uh -uh. Let's see the talk. Calm down. Run you know like already. your levels now. You know like your levels now. Okay. Now we're done. We're done. <laughs> Who do we have here? I beg. You know who be Raymond. <laughs> Jesus. I'm surprised you can't find our guy Raymond. Huh? Raymond will not get anything. Fine girl like you. What do you even see for that guy, buddy? I've been at the. <laughs> Let me ask her. A fine girl like this, they gather, go just the waste in time. They come here, call they look for Raymond. Almost like you know, waste your precious time. Raymond will never even see food, chop, two square me, never see. Now you waste your time, they find that they can't just get to soap. What's in the soap? I don't understand. This guy is not the yam from your mouth like this. Hey. Eh? Babe, come here, come find your guy, Raymond. We don't even know why she come. You're not just the yam butter for mouth. You don't make sense. Celia, shut up. Hey. What's in the worry? You don't have to grow in soap. Home. Please do fast. It's your motive for it now. Hurry up. You won't make bone choke me. Huh? Customer is always right now. I'm still eating, you're rushing me. I don't want that pay for my food. Your mother can wait for once. My mother cannot wait. Please do fast. Hurry up and go home. It's getting late, though. It's getting late. So, what are we going to do now? You know, just eat first and go home. Whatever it is, we'll talk about it later. Just just go first. Uh, I don't feel like going there. Go home. Oh, it's now. Go TV. <laughs> go in. Go in, go in. Now. Okay, you're still here now. We are closing already. Are you blind? Can't you see we are already late? What are they talk now? Try to do all food for my mouth. Oh, please, I don't have time for this sort of nonsense talks. Eat this food and, and, and go. Hi. Uh, 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 customer, please. Uh, uh, please, please, customer. Don't be offended. Yeah? We were actually waiting for you to finish. That was why she talked to you in that manner. Uh, just take your time and finish your food. Uh, just take your time and finish your food, but just hurry up a bit. Eh? Oh, well, like that. I don't know why she just uh, bad mouth me this kind of this kind of time. I don't uh, know. Me will be number one customer here. I, I understand, but uh, don't, don't be offended. Eh? No verse, no verse. Oh, well, I'm going to do the food self. I'm going to do the food. Uh, one meat and one fish. Uh, 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 700 naira. Uh, no. All right. Is there any other thing you no, take no, apart no. from? No. Okay, let me bring your change. Yeah. 
Hello? Hello? Raymond Chukura. Who is this? Listen, you are calling a wrong number, okay? So stop. You're disturbing my life. Why not listen to me, please? I am your grandmother. You were televised a few days ago in your recently granted interview, altering you didn't have parents nor relatives. And you grew up in an orphanage home. I was amazed seeing you on television speaking when you called your name and your digits displayed. Hello, hello Raymond. Are you still there? You said you needed to discuss something pivotal with me. Yes, Jasmine. You see, I want to sell off this place. You want to do what? Why? Why will you say such a thing? I, I, I think it's high time we went home. We need to go back to mom and dad. Annabelle, are you sure you are all right? You have been withdrawn of late, acting weirdly, doing some catch-ups, getting along. I mean, that is unlike you. Please, spill it out. My darling six, change is constant. You see, um, I want to help Amaka further her education to the highest level and then settle the security guard. Annabelle! Raymond, I advise you, Grandis Oman, this uh, request and speak to her face to face. You know? You cannot kill. This is still strange, okay? How can a woman pop up from nowhere and started saying she's my granny? Come on. <laughs> Seeing that woman is a risk, trust me. This might even be a setup. <laughs> the thing I want to say is, if someone knows how wide the stream is, he or she will not jump. But when someone doesn't know how why the stream is. He or she will jump six out of ten and will probably make it. It is better to risk a little than to lose a whole. Think about it. Good evening, Mom. I'm fine, Mom. Jasmine is also fine. She's in her room sleeping. Yes, Mom. I called to inform you that we'll be coming back this weekend. I know, Mom. I'm sorry for everything. I will explain when I come back. Okay, Mom. Thank you so much, and I love you. All right, Mom. Good night.
you look a bit sad. Are you okay? You seem like you're you're lost. Or are you looking for somebody? I'm actually looking for my grandson. Your grandson. He gave me this address as his place. He's living here. That's the address he gave me. I've been calling. He's not picking. Okay, um, madam, do, do you have any means of identification or, you know, number or picture? His name is Raymond Chukura. He's my grandson. I don't have his picture, but his name is Raymond Chukura. Raymond, Raymond. Yes. Um, the name sounds familiar. Okay. And you know, I, I, read, I live around the neighborhood and um, good. Raymond. Madam, this is what you're going to do, okay? You're going to go around and ask people and see if anybody knows him. Okay, you want to help me? I want to help you. Man. Oh, that would be nice. You're welcome. It's nice of you. Thank you so much. That's my grandson. That is Raymond. Oh, that's Raymond, my... Raymond! 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 What's that? Oh, Samu, we... Samu, we, Raymond. My grandson. Oh. How are you? I've missed you. Stop looking at me like this. I am your grandmother. There is slight resemblance. He's my grandson. Hold me, hold me, hold me, hold me. I missed you. I love you. I love you, my son. Actually, no place I didn't look for you in the market that day. I checked every corner. I couldn't see you. It was so careless of me. I knew. But there was nothing I could do. I searched everywhere I did not see you. I am so sorry, my son. Your disappearance gave your father high blood pressure. To crown it all, your mother died. And your father, my son, couldn't hold it. He died too. And when he died, I decided to take my life. But the worst was that any time I, 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 I feel like taking my life, somebody must come from somewhere to, to, to come and rescue me. I, I, I wasn't happy. But probably because God said, my grandson is alive and I shouldn't die. The very day I watched your interview, when you said, I am Raymond Chukura, Jesus Christ, I was like, this is my grandson. You know, I gave you a very good mark at the back. And I'm sure he's still there. I'm sure he's still there. Please, my son, however it is, whatever I've done, if you want me to kneel down for you, I will kneel down. Forgive me. I am back for you. I am going to live longer more seeing you today. Please, my son, I need to take you home. I need to take you to your father's house. Please.
Emily the baby. Emily Asa, Emily, the only Emily, Emily Potorinto, Potorinto, Emily the Emilia. Emily, I want to go, only you. Ah. Emily Afana, see as you they shine from head to toe, from back, from west, from chest, everywhere. Emily Potorinto! Emily Mex, you look great. You look good from head to toe, they call me Emily baby. Am I your mates? I'm going to have a selfie for you, yeah? What do you want to buy? Why do you want to my name? What do you want to buy? What do you want to buy? I'll ask you! Now why you slap me? Why do I slap you? Uh, because of that, they hear you over your food. What do they give me? Is that meaning your mates? Uh, Is she your mates? I better calm down, huh? I just call your shot, say I can't eat. Now you don't give me slap anyhow. Why do I slap you? You don't call me Emily baby. You open your cutter mouth, they call me Emily baby. See Emily, not try me again, no. Not try me again. You say no be your, your food, no they give me colos, eh? I for, I for man to that slap bad. You know what? I get out. Get out! No, they behave anyhow. But still, go call your shop. Call your shop. Slap. I can't leave my shop. Get out! Just get out! Nah, yeah. Very foolish boy. Foolish boy. You look with foolish. As I pay rich, they come here, mini baby. What are you there? Let me see you here again. With your tetra busters. Foolish boy. Foolish boy. Let me see you here again. Idiots. Emily, baby, you, you, you don't know your mates. Just now, eh? Come back here again, it's what I'll do to you. Idiots. Emily, baby. You don't know your mates. Because now, I, 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 I deserve food now. You don't In our company. Oh. <laughs> you see, I know the God that I serve <laughs> will always come through for me. She make him never the one you. Hey, he your man, madam. He had the good madam. He your man, madam. He had the good madam. Hey, oh, don't go Jesus. Again, oh, don't go Jesus. Again, he your man, madam. He had the good madam. He your man, madam. I don't want to talk to you. Get out before I leave. He had my madam. He had you. Emilia, my daughter. Why this mood? Huh? Why this downbeat attitude now? You see, I am very happy with this new development. Your siblings and I will be fine. In fact, we are very fine with this your newly found job. At least you will be able to take care of your younger ones. Eh? Wait, oh. Don't tell me you are a joy killer. You see this city? You must go. You must go there. Mama, it's far-fetched for me. The only regret I'm having now is telling Raymond that I won't be able to attend to him whenever he comes here to buy food. Hey, Emilia. You don't cease to amaze me. I regret everything I said to him. I do. It's okay. It's okay. Don't worry yourself. Whenever he comes here again, I will tell him how sorry you are. But right now, you have to focus on going to the city and focus on your newly found job. After all, you have been rendering help to that Raymond. Mama, I know that. He is like the elder brother that I never had. Emilia, I don't understand though. The way and manner you speak about this young man, is there something more 
that I need to know. Apart from this uh, 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 elder brother story you are telling me, Mama, this is your because I'm not buying it. Yes. Mama, I cannot answer this your question because it's difficult to answer. It's difficult to answer? Yes. He is our customer, a reliable one of that. He plays the elder brother factor. Elder brother factor indeed. Yes! Is that the reason you ran into my shop the other day, crying uncontrollably the day you went to apologize to him? Now you're telling me you regretted everything you said to him. Listen, my daughter. I am your mother. I betted you. I know when someone is in love. You are falling in love with that young man, Raymond. Yes. And you can't deny that fact. You remember I'm your mother. Mama. So stop telling me this, your elder brother's story or whatever you are uh, uh, framing. No. Mama, I need to go and finish. Uh, you have to go and finish. Where are you going to? You see? I said it. That is love confusing you now. You are so confused. Look at the kitchen here. Look at where we are cooking. And you are going this way. Look at the way. This girl wants to deceive me. You have forgotten that I, 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 I betted you very well. I know you and I know what you can do. You are deeply in love with that, this man and you don't want to tell me. Is it me you want to deceive? You can't deceive me. You are a small girl. What a kidding kunaka. You cannot deceive me. Look at how you are falling for that man. You, now you are getting yourself confused. Going right instead of left. Huh? Where are we? <laughs> hey, my grandson, here is one of your late father's properties. Yes, he was a billionaire before he died. Um, in my fan of Banini, this is just a nini out of what he's got. And you're going to have all of them in your name. You're welcome home. Mama, did you just say one of... And in Malifa Banini, this is just a nini. I'm the one managing here. This is just where I manage. And that's why I brought you here first. This is unbelievable. Yes, obviously. Read you? Do you need a bodyguard? <laughs> <laughs> he, can be, he can be his bodyguard. But of course, we have a lot of them. So, don't worry. Don't worry. You're not dreaming, bro. You're not dreaming. That's your grandma. You're not dreaming. You're home. That's it. Let me bring it to where I am managing first. You're not dreaming. You're not dreaming. Bro. You're, You're not dreaming. dreaming. This is yours. One off. From tomorrow, I'll start taking you around. You marvel. You're welcome. Uh, it seems I will, I will sleep here so that tomorrow all of us can move together. <laughs> 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 I'm, I'm, I'm welcome to sleep over. You're welcome. I'm too like an ass woman. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Okay, no problem at all, sir. My name is Ken Odefe. I run an advertisement company here in this um, in this area. So we are going around looking for people to run an interview and televise it, so that the government can see what is going on and come to the aid of the poor masses living in the trenches. So, sir, I don't know if you can give us a little time so that we can interview you and know who you are. Government. That one there. <laughs> sir, that is why we. We actually go around looking for people to interview so that, you know, while we are doing this, people might see your work and, you know, patronize you. So, 
I don't know if you can give us a little time to get to know you. On a pay for the interview. I um, will pay me. <laughs> we, we, don't, we don't pay for now, but we do, with the people watching, you might get help from somebody. Nobody knows. Yeah. Yes, sir. No, well, no, but no waste my time. Bro. No, we're not going to waste your time, sir. Uh, you, you can hold on to this. Okay, you can record, sir. So, first of all, good afternoon. Can we know your name, please? My name is Raymond Chukura. Okay. So, can you tell us, Mr. Raymond, um, from the way you spoke to us, we can see that you are a little bit learned, unlike the people we have previously interviewed. So, can you tell us, why are you here? Why is someone like you living in the trenches? <laughs> I was born and raised in the trenches. I was raised in an orphanage home. Yes, motherless babies. That place you call trenches is my home. I've been there all my life. I appreciate the orphanage home for raising me to this age. But at this time, I think is the best time for me to make move. That's why we are out here hustling. So, I want to know, like, with this um, barrel pushing that you're doing, has it been of any help to you and your family? Yes, it is not barrel pushing. Um, I know you'll be wondering why I speak good English. Yeah. I went to primary school. Okay. After primary school, I dropped out of school because nobody is willing to further my education. So what you see we do today is what we call iron condemn. Yes. We pick condemn irons, plastics, nylons, and let us sell to the people using it to reproduce. So it's a means of survival. We survive through here on a daily basis. Wow, oh, quite a story. I must say that your your story is really touching. And um, another thing I want to ask is, um, for how long have you been doing this? Mm -hmm. I've been into this for like um, nine months. Nine months. Yeah. Okay. At least I'm sure of two square mil a day with this. Wow, that is really touching. You know, that is why we go around you know, getting to know people so that we can put it up in the social media for the government to know that there are people in this part of the, the world, you know, suffering so that they can bring help to the poor masses, you know, because someone like you is not supposed to be here with the way you speak, you know. So, okay, fi the final question, sir, please. We want to get to know you know, your area, I mean the, the neighborhood, you know, the trenches. Can you take us around so that we'll, we'll be able to show the world what you people are going through, the place you people are living, you know? You want to see my hood? Yes. You want me to take you around my neighborhood? All right, I will. But don't waste my time. No, you're not going to waste your time, sir. Thank you. So, as you guys can see, we've already, you know, run an interview with Mr. Raymond Chikura. And with the way he spoke to us, it's obvious that he's a bit learned. Look at where he's staying. It's not good for people like him. I, I believe he deserves more. From the country, from the government, from people around. You know, so, you guys should stay tuned. We're going to take you around so that you guys will see what people like Mr. Raymond Chikura is going through on a daily basis. Thank you and God bless. Where you go till this morning where you they count like this? Because I don't believe in a debris. Debris where you they pick for street, now they give you this money. Say this nigga, I don't know, he don't run something for back where we don't know. I've been raising you this matter before now. Ike, this move could only involve himself with Ovila. Hmm? You want to upgrade go our level? I don't understand. Ben and Ike, which, which kind of thing are the like this now? All of us know say Raymond they day here now, they want G. How can they be fan like this now? It don't make sense. It don't make sense. Think on now. Okay, shut up. 
What you they No insult me, I no insult you. Oh, no you, insult you want the form lover girl? Now nah, Raymond, you want the love because of money. Hey, because of this money, what you see? I'm gonna leave this idiotic girl uh, as they talk, so that is on the yarn. You know they carry the plan and they give and they don't see money. Now you get your mouth. Now you get your mouth. Hi! Celia, I they talk, you they talk. There's no respect in self, you go insult him. I don't know what they do like, we're more our guy. All of us know that one. Why are you talking here? Mumu, see yeah. as you they follow man like sheep when no get shepherd. See, see, because see, of money. See, see, man, clear you, eh? You see, Ray, eh? See, matter what I want clear you, say, any day we actually go man for this cabal like this, eh? eh? Now your domot now go point and give, eh? No, because you see this matter where they run so, eh? Omo, I they suspect you. Una too will be like thief. You don't ignore us. If you're clever, they go first carry you. Oh, Wait till you the ginger for you legit. Your horse will legit. I will see you. I will thought they put the money for pocket too. Wait. Wait. I don't understand. I just follow you for back. You know if you want at least just make you stop, make you hear why I call you. Why now? What do I want here? You know, see what Tim Benedict and uh, Ike perform for there. On Emily, be. So be all of us get the same 24 hours. My miss made the logo hustle. My body they pepper them for my maternal. No vex, Ray. I, I see what Tim they do. And you, you see, sir, no support them. I do your side now. Eh, Ray. But you know, go just talk, say, now nah, 24 hours everybody gets. You know, say your guys, them, they, they hustle too. The only thing you go talk, say, they are also not too legit like that. How you take concern me? How is that my business? They chose in Lega, me I choose Lega. Maybe everybody go do what they in mind, call it. No vex. But apart from that one, Sefe, I don't understand. These days, you know, they even look my side like before. Come be like, say you the vex for me. See, wait, see, if I don't do anything to make you the para for me, eh, I don't mind. I go, I go kneel down for you. I will come on my clothes, make her dust your shoe. I will tell you sorry today, tomorrow, see, you don't, you don't, at least, I mean, Cecilia, I... Cecilia, you did nothing wrong, okay? I bear no grudge against you. Simple. I have to go. Sweet, see how you talk. Small thing, we won't follow talk, you, you won't leave me back at Komot. Wait, you forget how we did for these trenches. I'll be your Rigi, we'll be like family. Eh? At least, you won't just drop body Komot, you know, go take body, touch my body, at least. I can use that one, take I over body. Really? I balondo. But why did you like this now? Eh? Why did you like this? I'll be correct, girl, though. I don't even know what you did miss, safe. For this, this whole area, now me fine pass. I don't do it. It's easy living in the trenches. So that was how I left the trenches. I saw her. Due to the nature of my job, I was humiliated, dehumanized, insulted, while trying to feed. But God showed up with Ken because that interview, that interview changed my life. To crown it all, here we are, talking about things. Thank you very much, Grandma. Um, what did you say is his name again? His name is Ken. Ken, thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you, because without you taking him for that interview, I wouldn't have seen him on air. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome home. You see, your father's name is um, Daniel Chukura. You are just his replica. He called you Ufumbulanya Jisugo. It has never gone out of my heart. Even if something falls out, from my hand. Your name will just come to me. Who told me that a day like this will come? 
when I saw you during that interview, I was like, is this not my grandson? You mentioned your name, Raymond Chukura. I picked the number and started looking for you. And here I am today. You're welcome home. Your father was a billionaire before he died. This is just where I am managing. Just if okay, me find a banini, car banini out of what your father had before he left. You are a billionaire. Manu ko madokebo. Thanks, Grandma. Ha! If I die today, I will die a happy woman. Grandma, you're not dying anytime soon. Wherever your father is, Daniel, I know you're happy wherever you are. I know you are seeing what is happening here today. Your son is in your house. All thanks to God Almighty. All thanks to God Almighty. No, it's okay, it's okay, please. Don't go emotional. I promise my father is dead, no problem. But I feel him in me. And I promise to make both of you proud. Thank you. It's okay. Please. Thank you, my son. You're welcome. It's okay. Raymond, I must confess, bro, I'm super happy for you. This is actually where you belong, not in the trenches, you know. Well, um, everyone deserves good life. I am, um, I must confess. You see, without patience, you can't control money and power. I am excited that God has catapulted me to my promised land, which I'm thankful for that. And um, at the same time, I am excited that I did not join Benedict and his gang. Yeah. Because they would have killed my life. Speaking of which, my my team went to your area, I mean the, the trenches. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know the information reaching me is that um, Benedict and his hoodlums were arrested. You know? Yeah. I heard he's the gang leader. Benedict just wasted his life. I knew you would never end well. Meanwhile, did you hear of any name, Cecilia? Was that name mentioned? No, I'm, I'm not sure. I'm not sure because before we get to know, I will have to go to the studio tomorrow and gather all the information that I need. You know? But that's by the way, man. We should be talking about all these people. We should be celebrating you, man. <laughs> Cheers to good life. Thank you very much. <laughs> Man, this place is good. Billionaire, I have the cash. My stories has changed. Butter, butter, billionaire. Edging more cash. I can burst off money now. Sandra, Sandra. I have the cash. Sandra, baby. My friend. My friend. The oh. only friend I have. I beg you. Uh, uh, thank you. Uh, uh, what's up now? Fine. Uh. Nice. What do you want? Mm -hmm. My I'm friend, my friend. Come, 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 come. 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 I'm coming. Come. What is it now? Sandra. Sit. Hmm? Wait. What is it now, Sandra? You know, you usually be the one to tell me a story. Uh -huh. yeah? Yes. Today. I'll be the one to tell you. Tell me, tell me, what is it? <laughs> Do you remember Raymond? Raymond, the one you came here last time to tell yes, me yes, yes, that yes, uh, yes. he insulted me. Yes, yes, yes. What happened? <laughs> Raymond is not a billionaire. You say what? Raymond is not a billionaire. Chimo. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I don't understand. I don't understand. You mean Raymond now? That iron condemned guy. Raymond, the one me and you know, is not a billionaire. You don't mean it? Yes. Sandra. Huh? 
I heard his late father was a billionaire. Chimu, 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 Sandra. <laughs> hey? so, wait, 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 let me finish telling you now. Let me finish. I heard his grandmother located him and handed over all the properties to him. Raymond, that me and you know is not a billionaire. I am telling you, my French. Raymond. Raymond. Yes, see. Eh? Wonder shall never end. Ne? One inventory. Hey! Poor man is see today. Tomorrow he can be a millionaire. Sandra, you are right. You are right, my friend. Hey! Hey! See, let me tell you. You see me that you are seeing here now? <laughs> Tomorrow. Look at me, Sandra. I'm talking to you. Sandra. But I'm talking, look at Sandra. me. Sandra, leave me. Wait, let me finish. See me, eh? Tomorrow you might come here. You will not see me again, no? I'll be in a very big mansion, in a very again. big shop. Eh? And um, Sandra, mm. let me remind you again, in case you are going, eh? don't forget me. Why would I forget you? You, you know I'm your friend, Sandra. Why would I forget you? Know I'm your you friend. are my friend. <laughs> You'll be my friend. Sandra, Sandra. My friend. Eh? Eh, what did you say you want to buy again? Tell Sandra, me. Sandra, I don't need to. This face reminds me of my late friend. Oh. He's my grandson. Daniel Chukura's son? Exactly. Welcome, son. God Almighty did it. But that's a story for another day. I'll tell you how it happened. You know, I, I said I'll be seeing you tomorrow in the office, but glory be to God you're here. I want to be retiring from being the CEO. I want my grandson here to take over. He's going to be the CEO now. That's great, injecting new blood. Exactly. Can't you see it? Can I go to home? Exactly. So my son, you'll be working with him. He's a very nice and wonderful man. I've been with him for years, since the death of your father. He's been so wonderful. He's been doing well. He's my father's friend. Very good friend. Very good friend of your father. My late father's friend. Your late father. Good to meet you, sir. You're welcome. Thank you very much. I'll be looking forward to working with you. Thank you. Good. Thank you. Thank you, Mom. Oh, welcome. Welcome. How's today's job? Wonderful, thank God. Oh, that's I got good. good news for you. Good news? Yes. I can't wait, so. Madam Chukura has agreed to visit us later today with the grandson who is the new CEO of our company. Wow. That's a great news. They will be coming to visit us here? Yes. Oh, honey, wow. That's a great news. It's an honor, honestly. Oh, in that case, I'll go to market and arrange some things. I'll prepare something special for them because they are special visitors. That's okay. I'll be okay. Hey, they'll be coming. <laughs> oh. And don't forget, this is the first time she has accepted to visit us. Yes, of course I know. <laughs> They've not been here before. <laughs> okay. Unless maybe they came during the time you, you've not married me, which yeah. was not possible. <laughs> wow. Madam, please sit. My CEO, please have a seat. Thank you. I want to welcome you. So, so happy and excited that you visited us. I'm happy. Welcome. Thank you. I'm delighted. Mom. Dad. Yeah. Annabelle. Dad. Please come and meet uh, the CEO and then the of my company. <laughs> Good afternoon, Ma. Good afternoon, sir. Evening. How are you? Is this not the little Annabelle I used to know? Yeah, she is. Wow, she's grown into a big girl. Yes. Yeah, You're right. She's big now. Uh -huh. Annabelle. Mom. 
Mom, is everything okay with you? I'm fine. Please excuse me. Is she okay? I don't know. Um, uh, not to worry about her. Mm -hmm. I will go and prepare the table by myself because you are special visitors. <laughs> I'm coming. The young CEO, are you coping with your position in the office? Well, vision in progress. He has taken over. Yes, you know these young boys with technology, they have made some of us redundant. They are brain. It's too much. with you. What's that look for? Jasmine. Jasmine. Mm -hmm. You shouldn't have given that guy my number. You would have asked for me to give it to him or if I was ready to give him the number before giving it to him. That was so wrong and unthoughtful of you. Annabelle, that guy is so cute. Oh, Come on, he's on speed, doing extremely well for himself. Can't you see? I will root for him over and over and over again. Over that guy, what is that his name? I mean, I prefer Raymond to that guy dad is pinning on you for marriage. He's so toxic. <laughs> so Kingsley is not toxic, right? I knew it. What is even wrong with you? You are wrong with me, Annabelle. Allow me to do my say. I am older than you this day. I'm older than you. Let's Annabelle, go. Home. You are wrong with me. You are wrong with me. I mean, why would Cecilia allow? Benedict and go to use her like that. I had plans for her. I wanted to come take her out of the trenches once I settled. And you're here telling me this. Her life was cut short. That's the life we live in, bro. Maybe, just maybe, it was meant to be. From all I gathered, I heard that she tried escaping with IK on her on way to them that the cops were fully prepared and equipped, you know, and, you know, they gathered more information on their dean. So well, um, Cecilia and Ike were trying to escape, both of them were shot dead at the spot. Yes, I'm sure. Because I carried out my investigation properly. They are all dead. Cecilia, that girl is a beautiful soul. She deserves more. Intelligent girl with beautiful heart. She was not supposed to die like that. I had plans for her. I, I wish she can have another chance to live. Possibly right her wrongs. I'm so rest in peace. Amen. Amen. And um, his friend Benedict, he was just to court on the three count charges. Yes. I don't know. But the area is now safe though, you know, from all these hoodlums and nonsense people recently. It's a pity. My sister, mm -hmm. I am so happy. I am very, very happy. At least we have a very peaceful area. Hmm? Stop. <laughs> Benedict and his gang have been arrested. Good. Good, my sister. <gasps> See, I, I am so happy that I can at least close 
my shop anytime and go home peacefully. Yes. Walk on the street peacefully without nobody disturbing us. Those guys really dead with us in this street. See, in fact, my sister, I am so happy. So happy that they've arrested these guys. They are so terrible. At least we cannot have peace of mind. Huh? Thank God, though. Thank God, my sister. Hmm? Just look at a very young, handsome-looking man. Why did he choose this kind of a job? I don't know. I don't know. There are so many decent and good jobs. Very decent jobs. Why did he choose this kind of job? I don't know, my friend. I All the same, I am happy. At least I can stay in my shop here and live at any time. Yes. I even walk in the street. That nobody disturbing us. So happy, my dear. I'm happy. I'm so happy. Very, very happy. Since we thank God though. I am ah. sorry. What do I even offer you? Don't mind me. Use it wisely before it gets the nada. Cause this table fit done around tomorrow. Stop treating others as if they're animals. You cannot kill whom God has not again. You cannot destroy. Out, sis. Mm -hmm. You, Aproko. Well, he asked me out on a dinner date. Who exactly? Kingsley or Raymond? Who else? Raymond, of course. Uh -huh. What do I have to do with that Kingsley, Mama's boy? Now my big sister is behaving like the real daughter of Okozowa. And what's that supposed to mean? What I mean is that I am so happy for you. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. So was the excitement all about? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah. Tell me. So my daughters are now hiding something from their mom? Um, um we, um, I'm only happy for Annabelle, mom. You're happy for Annabelle? What for? What's the happiness all about? Uh, let me guess. Yes, I got it. Has she finally accepted to date Kingsley? Right? On the contrary, Mom. She's having a date with Raymond. And what is it with you and Kingsley? We all know that his mother is your best friend. But your daughter's happiness is paramount. Let her be, please. That's enough, Jasmine. I'm old enough to take care of myself, okay? Let it be. And I don't want this to repeat itself again. Mom. Please, for the obtained time, I do not have any atom of feelings for Kingsley. And you and Dad know this. As a matter of fact, my heart beats for another. Not another, but Raymond. And with my full chest, I agree to that. Mom, spare me that trash. Not in this house. <laughs> Mom! Big sis, don't mind Mom. Follow your heart. I am solidly behind you.
I don't know what has caught in over her. I thought by now she would have become more reasonable. You see that madness? <laughs> I'll have to take care of it because very soon I'll do something drastic. You have her to or you risk her friendship. I let you know exactly what to do. And then go put square and square. I believe you know what that is, Mrs. Okozoa. Hello? Hello? <laughs> so this little girl wants to get things complicated for me. You must listen to your mother. What I say is what must happen, period, and that is final. Mom. Mom, don't you get tired? Can't you give up on this Annabelle's issue? Annabelle and Raymond are seriously seeing each other these days and that alone tells you they are in love. So I will advise you and dad to let her be because neither you nor dad can separate Annabelle from Raymond. Not in this house. That will never happen. You are talking absolute rubbish. I don't understand. What has come over my mom? Mom! <laughs> this is awesome. You finally decided to take a position in the company. My company. I am happy. Mommy, it's not how you perceive it to be. Okay. Talk to me. Why did you finally make up your mind? Ma, it was the way my parents were going about the whole thing. I was not comfortable with their vibes anymore, but after speaking with Raymond, I saw the need to join the company. Good. Very good. Thank you. At least Raymond made you to do that. Isn't it? Yes, ma'am. It's alright, that's very good. And um I want to beg you of something. What's that, ma? My grandson loves you so much. Yes, I noticed it. He loves you so much. So I want you to do me a favor. I want you to watch his back. I want you to take good care of him. Love him the way he loves you. You know, the late father called him from Ulayaji Sogo. And that's what I call him. Mako from Ulayaji Sogo called. I don't play with him at all. Anything that will happen to him, let it happen to me. And you know that what that means. Mind you, he is a billionaire's son. I don't know if you know of that. I know, Ma. Good. I'll try my best. Good. Thank you so much. Thank you, Ma. Watch his back. I'll try my best, Ma.
like it. Oh my god. This tastes so good. For real? I love it. I will pay them for one whole year. Really? You are free to come here at any time, eat, drink and go for one year. Oh my goodness. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you a lot. Raymond! Raymond Tugura! Ah! Why are you looking at me like you don't remember me? It's me, Emilia, now. You used to come to my mom's shop to eat in the trenches. I'm sorry, but maybe you are mistaken with someone. Why are you behaving like this? Ah! Is it because of my week? Life don't be like that. Anybody if you blow, anybody if you make money tomorrow, if they call me team, because I, I pick something from your dust bin. My fridge be this. No, it does be be this. Bye, Awa. God damn. I am Kwande. I am Kwande. Plastic Kwande. Nylon Kwande. Human being Kwande. So you were the guy that came to my gate to pick up debris. I, I can't believe this myself. Raymond! Why all the pretense? What was all this for? Oh no, I'm gone! I'm sorry, my husband. I did not plan it this way. I allowed greed and Mrs. Patricia here. She was the one that lured me into this. I, I did not do anything, no. I did not do anything. Were you not the one that came for me for help? Eh? Telling me eh, eh, how you want your husband eh, to take over Daniel Chukura's company. Oh, oh, bro, is it on you? Babette, you, you, you were the one that initiated and masterminded uh, uh, Raymond's kidnap. Yeah. Eh? The, the, that day, he, he went to the market with the grandmother. <laughs> we lured him with beautiful and attractive toys. <laughs> if not that I intervened and insisted that we took him to orphanage home, 
because I don't want anyone's blood to be on my head, let alone innocent Raymond. She, she, she would have killed him. It's not for me. Shut up. W will you shut up? Where not do what I came to be? Telling me how that the Chukura tosses your husband around eh? like an errand boy and give him warm praise. I give him warm praises to his son. Eh? He said he, he, he calls him uh, the apple of my eye. The eye, the eye through which I see. The, 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 the eye through which he, he sees. The uncontrollable, uh, saying uncontrollable, that is the billionaire's son. And, and you say he pisses you off. You, you want to do? You want to, You want us to take him out of your way? Oh, okay, now look at you, my head. Yeah, we can shut up. Make sure now. Come, let me let me even ask you. Why are you this wicked? After everything my son did for you and your husband. Oh, wait. So. This is the way you decided to pay me back. Upon all the things my son did for you and your husband. So this is the way you decided to pay me back. It shall never be well with you. You see you. It shall never be well with you. Look at what she's wearing. We are in like an animal. I don't even know why you people allow that to. I, I will just tear everything now. You the ego, ego, ego company. Nearly, your husband does not know anything about it. Just squandering everything. I want to ask you a question. Why did you truncate my life? I mean, I was young. Innocent and naive. What did I do to deserve that act? Huh? Raymond, forgive me. Marono, because forgive us. Please forgive. It's the work of the devil. Woman, why did you allow yourself to be used? Why? I never came to you complaining that I was being used and tossed around. You went to the extreme woman. And for you, Mrs. Patricia, I'm totally disappointed in you. How can you concede to this evil plot? I thought you were a best friend. And as best friend, you think this is the best advice you'd have given to her? Is the devil Oh my God. I regret ever calling you mom. I don't want to have anything to do with you ever again. That is if you remain alive to pull through this wicked act. Jasmine, your mother. Officer, Sir. make sure these people rot in jail. Hey, you have your thing. Did you say your thing? Officer. Okay, no, Speaking, you messed up. You messed up big time. I insist you would have told me, nevertheless. Yes, you knew about all that, yet you kept mute. Now Annabelle is dead. What was that for? Ken, you would have prevented this. But no, you wanted to run the show yourself. Now look at where it has landed us all. Does that make sense? Ray, I'm really sorry. I never meant for any of this to happen. Nor do I meant for anybody to die. 
as a friend, I, I did all I could to, to save the situation. You know, as an investigative journalist, I needed to get my facts and my sources right. As I gathered all my information, I went straight to the police so that we can trail those culprits. Told me that Lolo Kozua was the masterminder, spearheading the whole plot. I'm really sorry. I, I never meant for any of this to happen. Even at that, Ken, you messed up big time. Because you. I can't burst off money now. Billionaire. 